Hey guys, we hope you are up for some science fiction sounding tales from the days of the space race. Just keep an open mind and enjoy the possibilities. Okay, so you have heard all about the Roswell crash and Area 51. But did you know about the top secret mission that was allegedly covered up by NASA and the Russian space agency? What if we were to tell you that the Soviet Union and the United States launched a secret mission to the moon in 1976 to recover ancient artifacts? Incredibly, the previous Apollo mission and even Russian flybys of the moon have reported strange sightings and the purpose of the joint 1976 mission was to investigate and recover possible technologies. The reason for the secrecy points to religion, of course. Such discoveries would bring about the end of religious control and apparently we are not ready for that just yet. Maybe the elite got that wrong though. Maybe we need a cleansing of our thoughts. Maybe such a discovery would open our minds to the endless possibilities. Maybe? Anyway, wait till you hear this. In April 2007, videos began appearing on YouTube that claimed to show a mission to the moon from August 1976. The person who posted them was William Rutledge, a former employee of the United States Air Force. Rutledge stated not only did his team land on the moon in secret in 1976, but they found an ancient base there. Perhaps even more amazing, and if his claims are true, they also found a female alien humanoid that Rutledge later described as being in a state of suspended animation, neither dead nor alive. They named the lady Mona Lisa. These claims seem utterly insane to most people, and most of us laugh at the thought of such discoveries. We find this far-fetched and unrealistic. So why come forward and make a laughing stock of himself? Maybe these claims are so crazy they might just be true. The truth is stranger than what we think after all. Rutledge stated that the alleged being was around 165 pounds and five foot six tall. One thing that he remembers was that she had five fingers and a thumb, something that led him and his mission colleagues to believe that these beings' mathematics system would have been based around 12 as opposed to 10. Rutledge further stated that he and his mission mates had only very basic medical training, so they made preparations to move Mona Lisa to Earth. The crew also investigated and explored a huge object spotted by the Apollo 15 mission. They were amazed to discover it was a huge ancient spaceship about 2.5 miles long. Not far from it was another small ship as well as what appeared to be a very old city. The moon city was named on Earth and referred to as Station 1, but it appeared to be full of scrap gold parts and only one construction seemed intact. They named it the Cathedral and took shots of pieces of metal of every part bearing calligraphy exposed to the sun. The city seemed to be as old as the ship, said Rutledge. Rutledge's videos were so popular that they garnered over 1.5 million views on YouTube. But a few months later, his YouTube account had been hacked and all his videos were deleted. What do you guys think of these claims? Whatever the truth, it is nice to think it could be true. Would you agree? Thanks for watching and remember, the ways by which we arrive at knowledge are hardly less wonderful than the discovery of these things themselves.